here we are, unboxing knife, bringing you the Samsung Galaxy Z4. Four. Four. Z Fold 4. Now, I was a fan of the Z Fold 2. Not the one because I was like, it folds. Is this a gimmick? What are we going to do? And I became a fan of the Z Fold 3 and I fell in love with it. And I went from the two to the three, but I never got to use the three a whole lot because as a tech reviewer, YouTuber, you're always going through phones. You never like the stay the same. But I deprive myself of using a phenomenal device. So I've been addicted to my Z Fold 3 for about two months now. He has. Using it nonstop in unison with other devices because I'm a multiple device kind of guy. I've but I'm so many phones. crazy excited to give this a try. So how do they make cases for these folds? That's that's what I want to know. Like so it's it's an it's an interesting case and we have one over here and it's basically two covers that go on each side it's and like then it folds in on it. Like a book cover. So I believe this is the 512 gig because we were running a special edition for Samsung. Now I'm trading in my old device so I don't get to keep the Z Fold 3. Oh. And I think with trading it in and getting some credits, I still spent like seven or 800 bucks. But I ended up getting this. I got a watch and I got a case with the built-in S Pen. What am I gonna do they, with the built-in S Pen? I don't know. They upsold me. I'm, I'm a sucker. We for got more gimmicks. reviews though. Like now you got more tech reviews. Now you can see if he spent his money worthy, <laughs> and you don't have to waste. Or you. Can there we go. You can see if I yeah, if I wasted yeah. my money, so you don't have to. Nobody needs this. Let's be clear. This is a want. Yeah. This is a luxury. This is without a trade-in. What a seventeen hundred dollar device. That's insane. It's it's literally two smartphones connected and sandwiched together. So when you think about it, it's it's about on point for the price and it's about a half a terabyte of storage. I mean, it's a tablet. You, you're just basically folding it in half. It's it is a tablet a, sandwich. A true tablet. And now, look at this. I got what they're calling this That's tan pretty. or sand or something or, or other, but you can see it's really sandstone. nice. Some people have called it sandstone. I, I it's beautiful. Brown, but it's different. A it's HL. It's HL white. It's unique, but I think the official color on the box is actually tan. Tan. That's boring. Right. Give me some like um, Home Depot paint names or something. <laughs> what would be a fun Home Depot paint name? You know, like something better than tan. Better than tan. Yeah, Come like, on, Samsung. Be creative here. So, but um, this is an unboxing. So now we're unboxing this twice, once before Three and now times. once there. So here it is, and you have this lovely little pull tab so this is it we're gonna set this aside is there anything under any cords something that's a thin box it's not like google google gets big boxes oh 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 okay they're hiding it in this flat that's little... easy you're gonna throw that out by accident how many people are gonna see that It'll be like a big That's... sticker. I don't. I go right. Well, through. okay. Well, I guess this is an okay USB-C to USB-C cord, so it, it's got some stiffness, firmness to it. So not like impressive. We're not talking like DJI rope style cord, but it's okay. And oh, if I had to guess, we're gonna have a little SIM ejector tool. This little guy, and then there's some papers. And this is your whole unboxing experience. There was Welcome. Nothing. That was that was. Welcome really... to the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 4, where you get nothing, no more. Ooh, I made a run. Z Fold 4, nothing in the box, no more. Z Fold 4, nothing in the box, no more. Okay, I shall maintain my five-day jobs. And I give it up, <laughs> He does. He's got five. Like, just five. Like, yeah, it's crazy. Everyone's got to have something. Some people, I collect jobs. So let's finish this experience. So you got to pull the tab. Oh, oh, did you just break it? I yeah yeah okay. So we've got no. a little okay. Well, that made me nervous. It looked like the screen came off. Okay. Oh. All right. Oh. Oh. So that's your screen. Is it a screen on one side and on the other? It's like you have a front screen and then a, a screen on the back. So that's a screen. Wow. This is a device. Hold on. Hold this. It feels like a wallet. It's a weapon. Yeah. Wow. See, this this will make me so nervous. I feel like I... Well, you know what? Wow. That is a nice seam. Like, yeah. So here's... 
the three last year, so we can see the technology hasn't changed a whole lot, which it shouldn't have, because this is a solid design. The thing that needed work was the inside. And you can see that just one day, it just started bubbling. It didn't crack, but my screen just bubbled. Now, I don't know if I have a screen protector around this, and I never took it off. I can't remember, but I'm like, I'm trading in it anyways. And when they asked the trading question, they said, is your screen cracked? And my screen's not cracked. It's, not it's bubbled. So we're training this in, but I've still been enjoying the blueberries out of this, but now I've got new blueberries to enjoy. I mean, this is solid. Three cameras too. Three, three. How many were on that? So the camera on this admittedly is three, but it's not good. Not good. This is not good. I believe they really upgraded this camera. I don't even know if they give us any- the same screens? It looks if, like this is taller. If they either. give us any paper the Same size, but I like the dual colors. So it doesn't give you even like the breakdown put here. It doesn't give you nothing. It doesn't give back. you nothing. Here. Z Fold 4, nothing in the box no more. Not, not like it used to. Nothing. It used to be like, oh, this is the camera specs. No, you don't even get that anymore. They don't even care. This, they, but, you don't buy this. You're clearly not buying this for the camera. Well, I, and this is the complaint from the owners of the Z3 is on such an expensive device, yeah. I should be able to take a stellar, stellar yeah. I mean, you got three, three lenses here. Yeah, and you couldn't. Really? You couldn't. I'm struggling. What's the point of this? So productivity, functionality, portability, ah. storage. I'm a business person, not a creator but they're pushing this to the creators. So they had to upgrade, they had to make it better. But what I can share is that the closing experience of this is completely different. So this experience, feel yeah, I that. like that, yeah. It's open, open that up, smooth. open her up. You have now, now experience this one and tell me what the difference is. This feels like I'm gonna break it. It feels a little bit like you're gonna break it. Now, this is a year old and it has literally maybe three, four months of solid use on it and most of the time, it wasn't even brought out of the house until the past couple it's like months. like a cheap plant. That one feels like it's made out of metal. Oh, a little bit of like some sort of metallurgy in there. Yeah, yeah. And and, and th I, I think that is too, but it's still, you know, but the screen on it, I think is much bigger. So let's go ahead and just do I don't know, I thought they are the little, same size. Well, I think that per the edges of the device, the screen has oh. changed. So let's see what actually lights up here. It right almost here. looks like the same size, but I can't tell because yours is, well, I feel that if you just look at the top of the screen and there, you can yeah. see that there's more of a distance between there and there and to the edges. It's not huge, but there's definitely more of a bezel. And you can see that looking all the way around. So here is a Z Fold 3 bezel. And now here is a Z Fold 4 bezel. Now, these aren't the only bezels we have to observe. Why? Because it's a foldable device, bezels. and this thing opens Wait, up. I'm sorry, did you say bezels? Bezels. Bezels. We could, the the outsides of the bezels, like oh, the outside. This of is a, this is new to me. I've this, never like the outside of a watch is yeah, the bezel. Yeah. I was just thinking that the negative space. So the outside of the this is the okay, bezel. The bezel. So now we have to look at the bezel inside. We're learning today. There we go. So this this is my screen. She's slightly dirty. She's used, that's why I use my device. Oh, wow, you can tell the difference right away. Right away, you can see, see that it is smaller. Maybe I'm just not seeing it. I don't know. Uh, well, if you if you pay attention, it's like, here and here, you can see the bezels are definitely smaller. Mm, okay, yeah, you're right. When you get up close, you yeah. have to see it. There's like a little mark. So you can kind of see the yeah. edges here, of the me. bezels. Yeah, now I see. You have to get real close to really see the difference. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, so that's one of the upgrades or one of the benefits of the Z Fold 4. And they both can stand up on their own. So they're like their little books. But this is out with the old, in with the new, the Z Fold 4. I Samsung mean, Galaxy Z Fold 4. You know, I wish I could say brought to you by Samsung. I don't know if you've But I bought this MF with my own money. So you best believe I'm gonna tell you everything I think and feel about the device so See, far. Honestly, I don't know if I'm sold as more than novelty. I really am not. I think it's cool, but how far do you think it's gonna go? I think you have to use one in your life to be able to tell if it works for you. That's fair, because it's I was the same with iPhone. Way. I said iPhone was not worth it, then I got an iPhone, then I'm like, all right, I'm an iPhone Then guy. you're like, now I'm yeah, stuck. Yeah, Once yeah, you get sense. in the iPhone, okay. you can't get out of the iPhone. I like to push the boundaries. I like to use Apple everything, it's except true. when it comes to my phone. I like to use Android because I like the flexibility, the customization, I like the control, I like the faster updates. I like all those things, which 
Apple's catching up over time, but Android has it right now they for always me. Had it. And that is why I like Android. So if you like this, if you like the video, you want to see me, you want to see more Kevin, like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget, give us a thumbs up. If you liked the video, give us two thumbs up. If you didn't like the video, until next time for the love of tech. Namaste. Namaste.